home now from Mitua. Uh, really quickly, I want to show you the magazine that I purchased at the stationery shop. Uh, I like to go there to pick up Japanese nail magazines every once in a while, or sometimes I'll, if I'm in the area, if I'm in little Tokyo and LA, I will pick some up. But normally I like to go to mm, this stationery shop. It's called Maido. Yeah. Oh, we also ended up getting some mochi. This is the chocolate banana. I'm having it with my mushroom coffee because I haven't had my coffee for the day. And let me quickly open the magazine. Okay, this is the cover. This is Nell Venus. I love Nell Venus. I like Nell Max. And there is another one, Nell Up. If you've heard of these titles, if you've heard of the magazines I just mentioned, um, they're all very similar. <clears throat> And a lot of them feature the same famous nail artists from Japan. So I wanted to thumb through this just to gather some inspiration because I haven't bought a new magazine in so long. I'm actually going to clean up my old collection. I have magazines as old as 2014. So I'm just going to get rid of a few of the old ones. But look at all this nail art. There's so much to look at. Look at this winter holiday one with the little snowman here. That's really pretty. I highly recommend picking up one of these magazines at the local Japanese stationery, Japanese uh, bookstores too. Uh, Kinokuniya has these magazines as well. Look at that. They look so cool. Wow. Oh, well, that looks really cool, the heart. What else is there? <clears throat> it's just pages and pages of pure art. Just pure, beautiful nail art. A lot of nail art that's um, popular in Japan is showcased in a lot of these magazines are really cool and they also interview if you can read japanese it by the way the the magazine i forgot to mention the magazine is obviously all in japanese there is no english and it's really fun to look at the pictures look at the products that they use in japan and the tools that they use i love to see what japanese nail artists like to use and a lot of them are featured on here. They even have like step-by-step -step on how to do some of these looks. It's really cool. Really nice. Love it. I miss Japan so much, you guys. So, so much. I miss getting my nails done over there. I miss shopping for nail supplies. It's just, it's not the same over here. It's really not. Love everything about these nail magazines and Look, another step-by-step -step how to. Oh, wow, look at these little characters here. That's so cool. She did it with acrylic. You can see it right there. That's awesome. All right, so I'm going to end this vlog here. I hope you guys enjoyed it, and I will see you in my next one. Bye. <laughs>